All right, some tips on how to care for your flute, starting with assembly. I'm going to take the main body and the foot joint and just carefully twist those together. I'm going to be careful not to bend and grab on the keys. Just carefully twisting those together and lining up my pinky. Now I'm going to take the head joint, carefully twist that on, and line that up where it needs to go. And then you have your assembled flute. Now for disassembly, same ideas. You're just gonna grab the flute, being careful not to bend any of the keys, and gently pulling off each section. Now when you're done playing, there's a couple things you can do every time to ensure that your instrument stays in good condition for longer. One of those is being swabbing out all the moisture from your horn. So I'm taking the cloth and the cleaning rod, putting a corner through, and just carefully swabbing out each piece of the flute. Starting with the head joint, now the foot joint, and when I go to swab the body, I'm going to do one half at a time. I'm not going to try to put the whole thing in through at once. That's how things get stuck. And just one half at a time, getting all the moisture out. All right, second thing you can do is you can take a clean rag or a clean microfiber cloth or a polishing cloth and just wipe off the body of the horn and all the pieces where your fingers touch. You're just getting your fingerprints off. And that's just gonna help things stay clean longer, stay in good condition longer. One thing to remember is that moisture is not our friend when it comes to woodwinds. So we're not taking water to any part of this flute at any time. And we wanna make sure we swab out all the moisture when we're done playing and before we put it away in its case. And here's more on how to set up that rod. We're just putting a tiny corner of the cloth through and covering the rod so that just the cloth touches the flute as it goes through. All right, here's an open hole flute with its plugs installed. I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to uninstall those. You're just gonna take a household Q-tip and just gently push those through each of the pads. Then you can tip your flute to the side and gently shake out each of those. There should be five total when you're done. All right, now for reinstalling those plugs. Um, it's kind of like contacts. If you ever put in contacts, you're going to put it on the pad of your finger and just gently press in the center of that key. Um, I'm not pressing too hard, just being pretty gentle about it and just making sure it's even with the rest of the key. So when I go to play, I can't really tell that they're raised or anything. It's just even with the key. And that's how you reinstall your open hole plugs.